Hi everyone. Well, I am an older woman here on TikTok. I'm 74. I don't know whether there are that many other women in their 70s here on this platform, but I love it and I really do value the feedback and the support that I get from everyone. But I would want to do um, a little series here on stereotypes. I do think there are a lot of stereotypes that uh, younger people have of older women, and I'd like to just question some of those and push back a little bit. I think the first thing that a lot of young people say is, you know, older women are just, you know, wrinkled and gray hair, and why are they trying to look beautiful? I mean, what's the point? They just they just don't look attractive anymore. And, you know, I understand this because the culture that we all live in right now is so youth-orientated, and there's so much discussion about, you know, this, the condition of your skin and how, you know, how many wrinkles you have and how beautiful you are. And Brands do not help us here because they are targeting, um, you know, makeup and skincare products to a younger audience. Lots of conversation about this, about why. And I think it boils down to, well, two things. One is that, um, you know, as you get older and you get wrinkles and you get a little bit, um, you know, drier in the skin and, you know, you just not, you don't, you don't do as much uh, justice for their products. I mean, how can you talk about glowing products or eyebrow products when the person you, that, you know, if an older woman is, is not showing them to their best advantage? I'm talking about in the minds now of brands. The second thing I think is actually a little bit more subtle and perhaps you don't think about it so much and I, I've actually made comments in other older women's um, pages when they talk about brands ignoring older women or not showing their products on faces that they're targeting or you're supposedly targeting you know anti-aging and, and wrinkled skin and that is um, a little bit strange and that is I think that brands like most businesses are looking to um, you know to build a customer base for the future they want to be targeting today women in their 20s and 30s, 40s, because they know they're going to have a good 20, 30, 40, 50 year uh, buying cycle from this group. Boomers are in their 70s. You know, I will be very fortunate and thankful if I make it to 85, 90. But I, I think there's a lot of that in the strategy of brands that they want to build an audience that's going to buy their products for the next 50 years. I really do think that is the case. And I kind of, I think I've given up on talking about, you know, why we're not invited to influencer events and why older women are not taken seriously. But it gets back to that comment about women over 60, 70 don't look good. They look wrinkled. They look old. Well, <laughs> I think there's a stereotype that we can shatter because I think beauty is, you know, is defined in a totally different way when you get older. And in fact, it probably should be as you're younger too. Beauty has got to do with what you are inside, what the goodness and kindness that you, generosity, compassion that you give to the world. We need more of this. <laughs> we need more of that beauty, the beauty that comes from just being a good person.